and pumping. So as you can see the angle in my hand. And uh, putting the guys through their faces. So our crew, our intrepid crew today is uh, Rick at the starboard sheet. <laughs> Benito's going to get ready to go on the port sheet. Get ready. Our skipper at the moment is uh, Rulof, Murray at the back, and Andre manning the main sheet. We've got probably a 4-6. Yeah. 4-6 uh, gusting here in Hooligan's Corner. We're approaching Table Mountain, as you can see. Um, we're doing about nearly six knots and we're about to perform attack. And you can see how the, the gusts are coming, nearly close on 30, 26, 30. Okay chaps, are we ready to do El Tacos? Okay, ready to come okay. Tacos! El Tacos! Okay. Okay. Yeah. Let her back. Let her push, 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 push. Okay, now yeah. flick off. That's it. Okay, wait. Oh, quickly. Quickly. Now, third turn, fourth turn, quickly. That's it. Good stuff. Well done, Danita. Yeah, got to ease the main. Ease the main. And bear off. Bear off. So watch the, watch the jib, uh, Murray. We're going to be on a bit of a broad reach. Ease the main. We ease the main. More, 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 more. That's it. Now, carefully, you don't go on a run. Okay? That's it. Ease the main more. Now, the trick is you've got to be careful when we get a gust that you don't let the, bull, the boat pull to starboard because then we can't let the main out anymore. Okay? So you've got to turn to port. And then as the gust pass, you go back again. Okay. Not too tight, Murray. It's fine. Yeah, I would ease it a little bit. Ease it just a little bit. Okay. So Andre is a bit nervous there. He's turned us a whiter shade of pale. Yeah. Uh, okay, you can hand over to uh, Murray, okay. next skipper. And tell him what you're doing before you hand over. Um, we're on a Careful, don't go on a run. Careful, careful. Yeah. yeah. Beam reach to broad reach. Um, heading for... Um, what's it? Uh, Lowberg Strand? No, not quite. What's, what's, what's that hill I'm doing? <laughs> uh, yeah, that's a little bit better. Yeah. yeah. Okay, that's it. Okay. On a broad reach. So, Murray, remember, you're going to get those gusts. And the gusts are going to want to pull the boat to starboard. So you've got to make sure that when the gusts come, you just burn a little bit, bear off slightly. Because if you don't bear off in time, the boat pulls broadside onto the wind and you can get knocked flat. Okay? No, that's not going to be pleasant. You're too much on a run, so go a little bit to ah, starboard. You don't want to go away from the wind on this point of sail, okay? Because you'll have an accidental jibe and that boom will come over the hell of a speed. So, that boom can come further. How far is, how far away from that running back stand? Okay, so what can we do to let the boom go out further? We can ease that, ease that running back stay. So, Tanita, ease the running back stay. Yeah, so you uncleat it at the bottom. Take the, take the, take them off, yeah, off the guardrail. There we are, now uncleat it. No, no, other side. The one that you've just, yeah. So you give it slack, you see that? Give it quite a bit of slack, more. More, okay. Okay, now you can ease the main. Andre, ease the main more. I say, good, more. Perfect. Okay, everybody see what we're doing? No, just leave it like that, because we're, when, no, just leave it on the deck, it won't fall in the water. Just make sure it doesn't fall in the water. Yeah. Where's that other chap? Uh, 
No, he's not. He's in front of us somewhere. So just watch out. Oh, I think I see him. But he has far away. Yeah, he's far away. Okay, there we are. Nice swell today. Probably about four meter swell, they said. With a stiff breeze. You okay? Feel that gust. So she wants to pull that way. So can you imagine if you you've already let your main out as far as it can go, for example. If you don't bear off, the boat's just going to come broadside onto the that strong wind and it's going to get knocked flat on the water. So you have to anticipate that gust all the time. And you want to make sure that that arrow doesn't go in the middle. Okay, that's critical. So don't go too much that way. Keep her on a broad reach. So here we've got, Rick was baking at 4 o'clock this morning. 4 o'clock this morning. Everybody's having, mm -hmm. we're all thoroughly enjoying this baking. We are totally speechless. So there you can see, what are these? Uh, Almond croissant. Almond croissant. Croissant. Where are my?